Welcome, everybody, to Fergie Talks. And today, we're interviewing the Killer Clown. So, what can we call you? Okay, Killer Clown it is. What is your favorite hobby? Stabbing people. I think we're playing charades. Um, where did you go to high school? Okay. Hmm. What was your first car? Mm-hmm. Okay. <clears throat> what is your favorite scary movie? I mean, yeah, that sounds about right. Who wrote these? <clears throat> really? What was your last victim? <clears throat> Seriously, guys, who who wrote these? Bob? Where's, where's Bob? Yeah, I'm coming for you after the show. I'm just saying. You and me in the parking lot, okay? <clears throat> Do you read? What's your favorite book? This, this one's a weird one, guys. What is your body count? Seriously? <laughs> I'll have a talk with Bob. <clears throat> okay. I, I've, I've never had a I've never had a guest actually not speak. I mean, this is about as close with the mime. No, the mime. You remember, Bob? I'm not even saying this one. Okay. So, uh, in the making of the. Killer Clown series. Um, who was your favorite person that uh, that you you know <clears throat> killed? Oh, me! <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot I was in that one. <laughs> I was uh, yeah, I was that guy at the beginning. Got killed. Yeah, they called me up one day on the set of Battle Mage Two, and they were like, "Hey, um, they want you in this Killer Clown video, you know," and. Uh, they're like, you're probably gonna get killed like right off the beginning, but hey, you get a part, right? And I was like, yeah, sounds that sounds good. Let's let's get on that. You know, a couple months later, fly down to Hollywood, you know, and uh, on the set, they're like, all right, act scared, and uh, you know, the killer clowns will come in and slush up and kill you, I guess. You know, you know, kind of '90s, uh, you know, scream slasher style. And I was like, all right, let's do that. You know. Anyway, back to the questions. We got a few more, I believe. <clears throat> what is your favorite mythical creature? Well, I didn't see that one coming. Questions to go. This might be a very, very short episode, everyone. Okay. <clears throat> if you were to ever collide with another franchise, like another movie franchise, 
Would it be Halloween, Scream, Jason, Elmo Scotte? <laughs> oh my God, somebody stop me. <clears throat> Nightmare on Elm Street or anything that I hadn't mentioned, would there, would there be one of those? Okay, kind of figured, kind of figured you wanted your own, you know. Okay, our last and final question, everyone. Before I get stabbed. <clears throat> Did you like the movie Titanic? Oh, okay. Well, at least we got some emotions out of you. And I think that's all the questions we have today. So... Anyway, I would like to ask you a personal question or two. Now, since you have a couple of um, short videos out, what is the plan for the future? Like, are you still gonna continue making a, you know, kind of a connected series of small shorts? Is there some big features on the way? Um, hell, even a book, video game? I mean, Killer Clown is popular to a point, like people like it, people like horror, people like slasher films, and you're kind of more realistic because, you know, you're just a guy behind a mask, right? I mean, nobody saw a beam of light like an alien or uh, somebody holding the Book of the Dead over there, you know, and summoning some spiritual entity or something, and then, hey, I'm gonna put on a mask to look human and disguise myself. <laughs> Okay, <clears throat> well anyway, that includes our interview with the Killer Clown. I hope you all enjoyed today's Fergie Talks, and hopefully I'm around for the next episode or so. So, uh, everybody sleep tight, lock your doors, and don't let anybody with a Killer Clown come knocking on your door or your window or anything like that. Check your closets, check under your beds. Uh, and on that note, I'm gonna go before. Uh, oh, I'm gonna. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna go. Yep, yeah, I'm out. Bye, easy, you boys. <laughs>